Something that I thought would never come to the Hive, and even just Bedrock Edition in general. I've always talked about it and teased about it to some friends, but I thought it would never actually come out, which is... Skyblock is going to be coming to the Hive. So today we're going to be taking a look at the blog post and see what they have to say about it. As I just said, the Hive are announcing a brand new Skyblock slash MMO server by the Hive. So we're excited to announce that this year we'll be launching a brand new Bedrock featured server, which is a persistent Skyblock MMO. Over the years, we've received countless requests for larger games, as well as one where progress truly matters. This is where our MMO will will deliver. And for people who don't know what an MMO is, it's basically a massive multiplayer online game or server with a lot of players on at the same time. And when you think of MMO, you want to think of games like World of Warcraft or Hypixel Skyblock for Minecraft's sake. We've made the decision to launch this server fully separated from our Hive minigame server. While it's being created by the team behind the Hive, that's pretty much where the overlap ends. The MMO being fully independent gives us a lot of freedom. It'll launch on an improved tech stack while based on our minigame server with many improvements and new features. Additionally, we can take a lot more risks without potentially risking the consistency and stability of our minigames. The MMO will better utilize and showcase the amazing features and capabilities of the Bedrock platform in 2024. Past this, we remain committed to game updates, mainly for Bed Wars being for seasons, cosmetics, anti-chi, and other day-to-day -day operations. We understand that you might have many questions, but it's simply too early to answer them all. Keep checking our socials for the latest developments and updates. Updates. So what does this all mean for the Hive? Well, what it means is that the Hive are going to be releasing a complete separate featured server from the Hive themselves. However, the Hive team who worked on Hive and, you know, the minigames and everything that we know about the Hive right now is actually going to be making this Skyblock slash MMO server. And at this moment in time, we don't have an exact name of the actual server itself or what it actually entails. However, there have been a lot of leaks around the community discovering what this server might actually be being screenshots and early footage of the actual server itself if these leaks are true i'm gonna genuinely say that it does look pretty promising in terms of what it can deliver in terms of an mmo rpg experience now that we know that the hive are going to be bringing a skyblock featured server to the bedrock edition of minecraft i just want to give my quick thoughts and opinions on it so the first thing i want to start off with is a comparison to another other MMO slash RPG like server or game that was on the Bedrock Edition of Minecraft a few years ago. Some of you may know it, some of you don't, but for people who don't know what I'm talking about, it is called Magic and Mayhem, and it was on Cubecraft. Magic and Mayhem had you basically going around different islands and collecting different elements to build into different armor sets and weapons. When Magic and Mayhem first came out for Cubecraft, I pretty much called it the Hypixel Skyblock equivalent of Bedrock Edition. The reason I say it's pretty much like Hypixel Skyblock but on Bedrock Edition is because at that moment in time, there was nothing as unique or special than what Magic and Mayhem offered on Bedrock Edition. Not only was it free to play, but it was a featured server game that everyone could play as well. I don't even think there was really any monetization tactics or anything that you would have to pay for. So for the Hive making their own MMO Skyblock server that has progression and that is a totally different featured server, I just hope that the Hive are going to be making a Skyblock server that is going to compete or be at the level of what Magic and Mayhem was. And the one thing I'll add here is I hope they don't go the pay to play route. We've seen it time and time again with Bedrock Edition and how egregious some of the pay features on there are, but to be completely completely honest, I hope that this new Skyblock server is not a pay-to-play experience. The one thing I joked about all the time maybe two years ago was joking that the Hive would release a Skyblock server in being like Hypixel Skyblock. My friends were pretty much telling me that I was high off the Kofium and that it would pretty much never happen, but we're here. My honest thoughts is that they can really make a very, very impactful Skyblock server if they do it right. If the Hive can make it similar to what Hypixel Skyblock has and in terms of the depth, 
the quality and the grind that you can do, then it's going to be a 10 out of 10 server in experience. There's, there's no comparing it. When it comes to featured servers anyways, there is no real grind or depth in a Skyblock server. There are other featured servers in Bedrock Edition that do have Skyblock, but if Hive are advertising and teasing this new MMO project that will deliver something that's never seen on Bedrock Edition before, and if they make it something similar to Hypixel Skyblock, it's going to be the best featured server in all of Bedrock Edition. Now, the only way I can see them messing this up terribly wrong is going down the monetization pay to play route. And my overall closing thoughts and opinions on the Hive's new Skyblock MMO server is that I hope it has the depth, grind, and overall quality that we truly are missing in Bedrock Edition. If they go to pay to play route and there is literally no way to play except you pay for it then it is going to be another flaw however this is going to be made by the same team who made the hive so to be completely honest there is some hope in the roster and with everything said that is my overall thoughts on the hives new skyblock mmo server coming to bedrock edition let me know your thoughts in the comments below and i will see you all in the next one